On the production pirates, uh, I was really loath to, you know, have it really the 3D taken out of my hands because I felt that the 3D was so much sort of part and parcel of the project. Um, the, it was the same as the lighting, the same as the composition. It's just another element. It's that element of depth, which is as important to the film and lends that, you know, our sort of puppets, you know, more real, more reality. And so I felt it absolutely important that I, re I retained that control of the 3D. And the only way of doing it was to actually shoot it in, in 3D. Yeah. It is here to stay because now we've entered into the digital world. Um, it was it, it was different when 3D was shot on film. Uh, you know, uh, it was always something that was never going to last just because of the organic st um, uh, composition of so sort of film and running it through projectors. But you know, the, how crucial it was to set it up. Now, sort of running it digitally. Um, you can show it on TV, it can be sort of projected. It's much, much e easier for um, both TV companies and sort of picture houses to show 3D. Um, I, I, I see it as a progression to, you know, even different forms of 3D and in the future, maybe in 20 years, we might be looking at holograms. And I think it's just a sort of step, step on the way to, to a newer, you know, different, more interesting future.